As the saying goes, how do you get to Carnegie Hall? Practice. The Radford Singers are participating in the National Concert Women's Chorus at Carnegie Hall in New York City on February the 16th. And we are so excited to hear from them today. But before we get to the singing, we're here more. Uh, we're going to hear more from Dr. Meredith Bowen. She's the director of choral activities. Dr. Bowen, thank you so much for being here. Oh, thank you for having us. So this is super exciting to be able to go because not everybody gets to sing in Carnegie Hall, right? It's true. It's very, very exciting. Um, and I think maybe we have about probably nine. 98% of our singers um, have never been out of Southwest Virginia. Oh, so wow. going up to New York City and experiencing the sights and sounds and, and food, we're yes. very excited about all of that. And of course, singing. Absolutely. What was the reaction when you guys found out that you are going to get to go? Oh my gosh, there was screaming and <laughs> lots of uh, jumping around. It was great. <laughs> that is absolutely incredible. Of course, a lot of work goes into this. Talk about how much you guys have been practicing, because there is that saying, it takes practice to get there. It's true. Uh, so we started practicing in uh, August when we started school. Wow. Uh, yeah, so uh, three pieces that we're singing as a, as a solo spotlight mm -hmm. um, and we'll be, we'll be there. Um, so we started in the fall, three rehearsals a week, uh, an hour and a half each rehearsal. Wow. And then um, they've performed the pieces a number of times um, up to this point. We have yeah. a couple more and then we're off to Carnegie. Oh, that's awesome. Are you pleased with how things have gone so far? Do you, oh, absolutely. Are we ready? Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. Um, they are, they've been working their tails off and yeah. I'm super excited for okay. them. Okay, briefly tell us, what are the three songs that you're gonna be singing? So the first one is called Kua mm -hmm. by uh, Miriam Kuri. Uh, the second one is Stars in Your Bones by Joan Shimko. And the last one is Sing Wearing the Sky by Jake Runestad. And it's all about finding home within yourself. Ooh, that's deep. Okay, very cool. All right, well, thank you so much, and we're going to let the singers take it away. All right, thank you.